Hey, this is Al and Lisa Robertson. You know us from Duck Dynasty, uh, even though I don't have a beard. Uh, you know, somebody has to look good on that show. Uh, but uh, we've uh, written a new book called Desperate Forgiveness uh, that we wanted to share with you about. It's a, it's a blessing to us. It's really a sequel. Our first book was called A New Season. Uh, and in that book, we told our story, uh, which is filled with a lot of heartache, a lot of pain, a lot of difficulty, but also we finally found our place, uh, you know, kind of before God, prostrate, just laying out saying, we need help. And God, of course, gave that to us. This book is sort of what we call a sequel yeah. uh, to that book, because this is now talking about what we've been able to do and bless other people's lives. And so we kind of take a biblical look at stories that are there that are timeless about embracing God's forgiveness and extending it to other people. And so uh, it was a, a lot of fun for us to write it and it's been a blessing. Mm -hmm. You know, the Bible tells us in order for us to be forgiven, that we must forgive. And so if there's someone out there that you know of that you have not extended forgiveness to or you have not asked for forgiveness, um, do that now. Um, all it's going to do is cause problems for you later on. Um, the, the longer it goes, the bigger it grows. And so I would say for you to go ahead and do that now. And that's the most important part. So here's our, our challenge to you. Uh, our challenge to you is this week to take an inventory, look in your own heart, see any relationships that, that really hurt you, that you feel angry about, that you feel bitter about. Could be someone in your family, could be somebody at work, could be somewhere else. Take an inventory. And even though you may not have an opportunity to talk to this person about it, go to the Almighty and ask for the power to be able to extend forgiveness. Or if there's someone you need forgiveness from, ask the Almighty to give you the power to say, I'm wrong, I'm sorry, I need help, would you please forgive me? So that's our challenge to you this week. Uh, let it be an action step. Don't let bitterness set up a root in your heart because it defiles many and it causes trouble and you don't wanna have that in your life. So we're giving you that challenge this week, desperate forgiveness.